Hello everyone, my name is Ashish and in this video I'm going to show you what is the difference between distinct and values functions. So I have two tables, one dim and another one is fact table, both having a, a single column product. In dimension table I have three products A, B, C, whereas in fact table I have taken four products A, B, C and D. Now to show you uh, the relationship, uh, these two tables are not related with each other. Now let's write a measure for uh, values and distinct. So I will click on new measure. Write distinct example. Is equals to distinct of product. I will take dim product. And since distinct returns a table, so I will uh, take uh, count rows of this table. So that uh, this will return me the number of rows uh, that is returned in distinct function. Enter. I will copy this and uh, create a measure for values function as well. So instead of distinct, I will replace with values okay now we have two measures uh, one distinct and values and that is counting rows from the dim table okay which is having uh, a b and c so it should return me the count as three so i will take a table and take these two measures distinct and values both the measure uh, are returning three as uh, the output now let's take this dimension product as well in the table so for all the uh, products it is counting as one now what is the difference between distinct and values so i have seen many videos on this topic and i was not able to find out what is the difference so i thought of making this video uh, so that it's clear to you guys so the actual difference is when you relate these two tables. When I am uh, creating a relationship between this product from dimensional table to the fact table. See, I have uh, three products in dimension table, whereas four products in fact table. If I go to report, you can see the difference. From distinct, we are getting only three rows, whereas in from values, we are getting four rows. Why? Because we have uh, uh, one another product in fact table. So if you have a requirement where you want to calculate all the products that is there in fact table as well as in uh, dimension table. So in that case, you can use values function. This is the difference between distinct and values. Let me know if you were able to understand the difference. So thank you everyone. That was it for this video. If you like my video, do not forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you.